Hello everybody and welcome back to Mr. P channel. You are one of the lucky ones who's got Samsung Dock Station, yes? And you want to do some productivity, uh, like creating documents, slideshows, presentations, spreadsheets, and etc. In this video, we'll show you a couple of apps that you can use besides Microsoft Office. And I'll explain to you why I, I'm using something else than Microsoft Office. Um, main reason while I'm using something else, a Microsoft Office on a deck station is at the price. Um, during a demo, they showed that you can do a, a slideshow presentation and then save it and email it and then everybody's happy, but you need to pay for that. Like you can see my office home and office personal is $5.99 a month or $7.99 or a month and $5.999 a month or, well, a year, sorry, or $5.99 a month. So it's extra six pounds a month. I need to, um, I need to basically pay just to use this on my Samsung Deck Station. So as a quick demo, I'll open, let's say, Microsoft Excel. So it all runs perfectly, loads up. It gives me all the templates that I can use. I can go straight into a blank file and I can start editing. Let's say it's gonna be name, date of birth and level. So let's say first name is John, date of birth is, oops, 1985, level 500. So it's all, you can edit, you can do all the, all the things that you expect you, you need to do or you expect it from Excel, like add up, multiply and etc. It's all fine and you can insert all the chart shapes data formats, everything. And if you really got all your file and you have all your files saved on one drive, this is best app to use, but you need to pay a monthly fee to use all this. Otherwise you'll be able only to view the file. If you don't pay the monthly subscription, Microsoft monthly subscription for Office 365, um, you only view the file, you cannot edit and you can't create a new files at all. So this, I paid once and I just, for this video purpose, I, I, I spent six pound and I'll see, like you can obviously browse, you can connect to your files and accept your on, online storage is different than OneDrive. The same as with the Word, you open up and this gives you a bunch of templates to use, or you can just go to a blank one and you get whatever, what you expect from Word, like formatting, layouts and etc. It's brilliant to use. Don't get me wrong, it's brilliant to use. But I don't really want to spend six pounds or more a month to just once in a while do a document or two or spreadsheet. Obviously, if, if the company that you're working for, they paying for that, just go for it. It's not your money, just, just go for it. Just say, yes, I want a deck station. Yes, I want a Microsoft Office. It's brilliant. But for home users, well, there is a, always different options. Like you can use the actual Google Docs, just go going by drive.google.com. You create, you're logging in, you get all your files here. You can create a files like document slideshow sheets and etc. So I created a couple of them like YouTube demo spreadsheet. You open up and you get your Google, uh, Google Sheets online page where you can edit, you can basically do all your data crunching things. So let's say, um, you, as you can see, you get all the format, you can format, insert, and tools and everything is here ready for you. And when you're done, you just, it says automatically saving, all changes saved, you close it, you go to a totally different computer. Is it Mac or Windows or Linux or Chrome OS? Doesn't matter, you go to this website, you're logging in and you have all your software there, all your documents there. And obviously you can save them to um, Excel, PDF, you can switch to, it to uh, as you can see, comma separated values, switch to your data file, CSV, it's, it's, it's multiple versions to use and it's free. And come on, you have a Galaxy S8 phone or S8 Plus, you already have a Google account. That's all you need to do is just go to this website, log in and straight away you have your 15 gigabytes of free storage to use and you can go for it and edit it and etc. and it's all fine. But still, this requires an uh, internet connection. So you connected your phone, your S8 or S8 Plus to a deck station, but you don't have a ethernet or you don't have a Wi-Fi. And you don't really wanna pay six pounds or eight pounds a month for Microsoft Office. 
So the last solution is using the program or office, which is called, and let me quickly find out, I think it's called HomeCon or something, exclusive. HomeCon, that's the one. If you go to a Galaxy store and you go exclusively to the part where they show a program specifically for Dex Station, as you can see in this slide, is this screenshot at the top, Samsung Dex. If you download this office, it gives you a bunch of different programs to use, like Excel. Excel is basically your spreadsheets. Show is your PowerPoint. Word is your Word. And this is a thing called Publisher. Is the equivalent to Publisher? So let's go and let's say Word. I open up Word. Straight away it opens, loads. I can new I open a new file, go to a cloud where I have my cloud my cloud storage is connected. So you saw this YouTube demo spreadsheet. So I'll go in there. It connects right now to my Google Drive. At the bottom, YouTube demo. And it's not opening. Why? Well, it don't really talk to Google own formats. So what I need to do, I need to actually save it as an Excel spreadsheet. So let me do that now. Come on, load up. That's why it's fine, the Google Drive is fine for me to use, but it takes a while to load, especially if I'm using this on my Chromebook. If I have a big spreadsheet and I need to open this on this slowish device, it takes forever. So download as Excel spreadsheet. So YouTube download finished. So let's go, let's find the file. So it's in the downloads folder, it should be in the downloads folder. So somewhere here, there's a bunch of files downloaded, uh, downloads folder. So where are, where are you, where are you, where are you, where are you, where are you? Yeah, I saw it on the bottom. There, that's the file I need to open. So obviously I can open straight away, it gives me suggestions. If I clicked on this file, do you want to open with cell, Excel or Sheets? Let's try with cell and see what happens. So that's the name there where I punched in. And the same I can see here, name. So right now I can edit that file and I close the app, noob. Basically here I can, I can edit name, date of birth, I done it, let's say file, I want to save as YouTube demo 2 and I want to choose my Google Drive, it's login, logs to a Google Drive, I can go to YouTube demo and I click OK, go to there, go to my Google Drive and in the next seconds or so, it should be a file here, YouTube demo 2. So um, you have basically a couple of options. I just showing you free main ones. Microsoft Office is gonna cost you a month to run. Let me refresh this page to make sure it definitely happened. I'm just giving you a demo and it's gonna crash, so it's gonna be brilliant. <clears throat> All right, I know what's happened. Okay, with this program, you actually need to exit before you can. Well, when you press save, you need to exit the program. That's when it's all upload happens, and that's when it happened. So I will show you again in a, in a couple of seconds. But you have three options. You have a Microsoft Office, which is going to be chargeable. So you need to pay a monthly fee to use it. Obviously, you can download for free and use it. If your boss paying for that, go for it. Use it. It's brilliant. But if you have no one to pay for your Microsoft subscription, there is two options to choose. Microsoft, um, Google Docs, which you go to drive.google.com. You log in and you can use it. Obviously, there is the Android apps like Sheets. You open Android app Sheets. But what this one is, well, it's it's created for mobile devices. So if I open the file that I just edited with the other programs, that's what you get. It's a big, everything is zoomed in, everything is big, blown up, as it's not user friendly, friendly to use on a deck station. So don't use apps. If you if you want to stick with Google Drive, just go to the website and use it. But if you don't have an internet, Wi-Fi or Ethernet, and you don't want to pay monthly subscription to Microsoft, there's always this Hancom, Hancom Office where you can um, 
edit all the files. So I click new file open. So I want to go to okay, okay, close it wrong way. So open is you can browse on your phone, phone uh, cat folder structure, or I click cloud, Google, Google demo, YouTube demo. That's my file that I just created a couple of seconds ago. So open up. So I done all this, all the, all the bunch of things that I want to do on there. And if I go save, all the files immediately, but it will, well, it won't be saved immediately on the cloud. A, you need to be connected to a browser, to a, sorry, to a Wi-Fi or Ethernet to save the files in Google Drive. But always, if you don't have an internet connection, you can always save it to somewhere on the phone, like storage, and I'll save it into, um, so this is on my phone. Um, yeah, why not? Let's save it to my documents. Click OK. Saved to a storage, my documents. So I close that. Let me open my file manager. Internal. My documents. And that's the file. I click on it. And it opens and I can edit to my heart content. So I hope this video shows you, well, more than you knew before that don't stick on there with Microsoft Office. There is a bunch of ways to edit your spreadsheets and documents and etc. on the tech station. I love this this Hong Kong uh, Office. Brilliant. I love it. It's, it's free and it's near the same uh, functionality as a Microsoft Office is. So there's loads of things to do. And like I said, I, I just Excel fanatic. Data, data, data for me. And I can do all the sorts here, I can formats, data tools. It's all the hardcore formulas works in here, like is working on um, Microsoft Excel. So for example, V look up straight away. I have a suggestion, gives me a, a cheat sheet, what needs to be in there. I want to look for value this in here and bring me value two. So also it's going to give me error because there is nothing here. But anyway, it's, it's, it's all hardcore things you can do and straight away equal uh, functions, gives you functions, everything. What, what's with the same you can do, some, what kind of things happening. So Microsoft, brilliant, if not you who's paying for a monthly subscription. Maybe you want to pay for one subscription. It's, it's, me is not the person to judge. But there's always more options to go for than just um, documents or Microsoft Office. You can always use Google Docs. You can always use this Hancom Office, which is, I believe, chargeable if you try to download this. If you try to download all these programs to any other Android device, it will be chargeable. But if you're downloading this only for DeckStation or you're downloading via deck station so you connect your phone at deck station and then you go to a galaxy store and download it i believe this way is free but if you go to google play store and try to search for this office hancon office you're gonna have to download not only this but other program which is called hancon sync and that is where all the ads comes up and just just don't go there i tried it it's, it's bullshit just don't go there so stick with basically three options, which ones you want to choose. Microsoft Office, yeah, okay, chargeable. I'm using once in a while, open files. While my membership is still happening, it's probably going to be canceled in a day or two. But anyway, brilliant. Google Docs, fine if you just want to quickly edit a file, nothing major. But if you have a biggish file and you want to use for free, Hancon, I need to rename this. Income office. Go for it. Free for Dex users. Just download it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope this video wasn't long for you. Don't forget to click like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode of Can You Dex? And um, bye. See you in the next video. Let me shut down this recording. I just need to press this button and I'm going to say bye.